What's up, Jaywalkers? We're back at it with another reaction, and this time we're going to be watching Season 1, Episode 4 of Buffy. The first three episodes have been pretty solid. We're enjoying the overall feel of the show so far, the characters, and last episode, we just really enjoyed the twist with Amy and with it actually being her mom inside of her, trying to relive her glory days. It was some crazy shit, and... A nice little twist um, that that I definitely liked, but it was a solid episode all around. Mr. Giles did his freaking thing, um, saving Buffy, and he was getting into it. We loved it from him, and then Buffy taking care of business as she does. We enjoyed it all, but we're ready for episode four. To see what we get for reactions will be over on my Patreon page. Link to that will be in the description box of every video over here on YouTube if you want to check them out. Just feel free to hit the link and do so. That being said, let's go. All the screams are valid. It's even more valid. Okay, okay, oh. You all right? Thanks to you, you hurt your hair. I love the dream. Finish my solo and kiss you like you've never been kissed before. <laughs> Sand of the man. You're drooling. Their ancestors will be here long Pretty great after dream. we are gone. If you read the homework, you should know the two ways that ants. Miss Summers. Turns out Ways Willow's dreaming now. Answer communicating. Um, uh, uh, touch. Mm -hmm. And. Touch? Into something? B.O. <laughs> Thank God someone finally. That would be touch and smell, Miss Summers. Chapter 6 through 8. By tomorrow, people. Can I see you for a moment? Problems at your last school? Well, what teenager doesn't? Cut school. Can't wait to see what you're gonna do here. Plenty of special Dr. things. Ben. It'll save your ass. First rate mind, and you can think on your feet. Imagine what you could accomplish if you actually did the the homework thing. I think so. I understand sucks. you probably have a good excuse for not. I don't care. You should. I know you can excel in this class, and so I expect no less. Sorry. Don't be sorry. Be smart. Be smart. And please don't listen to make him eat that permanent record. What do you say? Okay. Chapter 6 through 8. He might be a demon, but I kind of like him. Uh, I didn't like him, and it sucks he won't be able to see any of his drinks. Get up there, Sandy. He was disgusted with him. She's not my type, though. Girls really gotta have something to go with me. Something like the lobotomy? How many times you score? Well, uh, yeah. It's just a question. Have we talked in today or the whole week? Ooh, do we come? What are you doing? Work with me here. Dwayne had the nerve to question my manliness and just can give him a visual. Who's showing? Who's that? That must be Angel. Weird guy that wondered about all the vampires? Yeah. Weird ass That's motherfucker that you. shows up. Well, he's buff. At the most I think he's buff. He's a very attractive man. I mean, that never came up. I'd say it's nice to see you, but then we both know that's a big fib. I won't be long. <laughs> no, we we'll just give me a pee and then disappear into the night. Right? You're cold. Look cold. Give her your jacket. You got lots it's a balmy night, man. no need to betray me. You better get up on that stage and perform. Attention. To somebody with a big fork? He's coming. The fork guy. You throw it out. Okay. I'll give you improved marks for that one. We're gonna throw it out. It's a strong visual. I have to go. Sweet dreams to you too. The guy said, fork guy. You've got a too many guys in your life. <laughs> More. Guess what I just heard in the office? No Dr. Gregory today. What happened? Is he sick? They didn't say anything about sick, something about missing. He's missing. 
but with short skirts, I kind of got, yeah, yeah, they said Miss, which is bad. If something's wrong, yeah. Sorry, I'm sure he'll. Ah, oh, yeah. Could you help me? No, we will stay away from your uh, demon ass. Looking for science, 109. I go there every day. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, where is Mall. I'm going there right now. It's not far from the varsity He's field where I took all. Blaine thinks he did something. Oh, you're it's gonna funny how the earth never opens up and swallows you when you want it to. Meet the master. What's wrong? Dr. Gregory dropped his glasses. Why wouldn't you pick them up? Natalie French, and I will be substituting for Dr. Gregory. Do you know he's coming back? No, I don't. Notes tell me you are right in the middle of insect life. Mantis is a fascinating creature, forced to live alone. Who can tell me why? Well, the words bug ugly kind of spring to mind. <laughs> the reason they live alone is because they're cannibals. Ugh. Oh, well, it's hardly their fault. All of them, the female is larger and more aggressive than the male. Nothing wrong with an aggressive female. He's got it coming. The California mantis lays her eggs. In the worst way. He's played his part. She covers the eggs in a protective sack and attaches it to a leaf or twig. She's done her job correctly. In a few months, she'll have several hundred offspring. Model egg sacks for the science fair. Who would like to help me do that after school? Good. Horrible. I wonder what she sees in me. It's probably the quiet, good look stuff with a certain smoky magnetism. You two are probably a little too young to understand what an older woman would say to younger men. up for my one-on-one -on -one with Miss French today. When's yours? All right, tomorrow. Guess that's what they call a natural selection. Guess that's what they call a rehearsal. Figure that out. You're about to find rehearsal. that out. I'll only be here as long as I can hold my breath. <laughs> Drink this. No, thank you. No, thank you. I've what never seen. Mean? That was new. Who'd want to hurt Dr. Gregory? I've seen a lot of new shit, Xander. Uh, he didn't have a lot of new unfortunate shit. I liked him. So did I. He was killed on campus. I'm guessing the last day we saw him. How'd he work up? He didn't change his clothing. This is a question that no one particularly wants to hear. Where did they put his head? <laughs> Good point. I didn't want to hear that. You know you, you never want to hear coming. that. Yes. Ever in your fucking Practically shredded, but uh, nothing like Dr. Gregory. Work guy doesn't do heads. What's out there besides Civil War men? Oh, this is fun. We're on Monster Island. We're on a hell no. The pleasant things do gravitate here, it's true, but uh, we don't know there's anything besides this chap. He's still a likely suspect. Time to go hunting. Not until we know more. Please promise me you won't do anything rash. Cross my heart. Here she goes. Shouldn't be out here at night, little lady. Dangerous. Yeah, but you. And anybody else who tries to sneak up on her like that. Way too damn. Oh! Oh! oh. Here we go. When you assured me, you wouldn't. Yes, I lied. I'm a bad you see someone with a fork? More like a jumbo claw. I saw something else. Something much more interesting than your average run-of-the-mill killer vampire. Miss French, the teacher that's subbing for Dr. Gregory. Yes, yes, she's lovely. Well, proportioned is heading home. The claw guy takes one look at her and runs screaming for cover. What? Petrified. Of Miss French? Uh-huh. So I'm an undead monster and that can shave with my yeah, hands. Perhaps it would be a good idea if we kept an eye on her. And I better get to class. ...or decomposing. I'd stay away from D-words altogether. But you witnessed the event, so this way, please. Well, no, I'm... A counselor. Everyone who saw the body has to see a crisis counselor. But I... I really believe if we all reach out to one another, we can beat this thing. I'm always here to talk to a counselor and start the healing. You have to heal. No, Mr. Flutie, I do Heal. Don't... I'm trying to save his ass. I'm alive, and then who's in the fridge? It really gets to a thing like that. I lost like seven and a half ounces. <laughs> way swifter than that so called diet that I kill a teacher every day just so I can lose weight. I'm just saying, when tragedy strikes, you have to look on the bright side. 
You know? Even yeah. Mercedes. She is something else. I think you meant pollination for number 14. Oh, great, a pop quiz. Hell no! Wait! Not saying she craned her neck. We are talking full on exorcism. Which You're reminds me, how come Wayne's one of the worst Blaine's things we've ever seen? We saw a fucking decapitated body. Try looking under things that can turn their heads all the way around. Nothing human can do that. There are some insects that can. What are you going to do? My homework. Hi. Oh, hi. I was just grabbing a snack. Can I fix you something? Wow, if this were real, the bugs would be... Big as you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, where do we start? I've done something really stupid. I hope you can't forgive so me. So is Andrew. Oh, forgiveness is my middle name. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, it's Lavelle and I secret with your life. <laughs> I don't suppose you'd like to come to my place tonight to work on it there. To, uh, your place. Can't wake up from this nightmare. But we can save you from it. Ooh, yes! rotate its head 180 degrees while waiting for its next meal to walk by. Ha! Well, come on guys. Ha! Oh, well, Miss French is sort of big. For a bug? A pretty whacked out vampire scared to death of her. Factoid 3, her fashion sense screams predator. It's the shoulder pad. Chum at Oxford, Carlisle. Advanced degrees in entomology and mythology. Entoma who? Bugs and fairies. Any of that. If I recall correctly, poor old Carla no, no. Miss French yesterday. Yeah, if Miss French is responsible for... Xander's supposed to be helping. Hey, don't panic, I'll warn him. But don't I need you panic. to hack onto the coroner's Buffy's office. Buffy's on! Computer invasion that Willow's performing on the coroner's office. One, one assumes it is entirely legal. Entirely? Yeah, didn't see it. Couldn't have stopped you. Good idea. We're all good. Hey! Legal. Hey! Not what she seems. I know, she's so much more. I'm gonna have to tell you something about her and. Technically, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna... I see. So if she's not human, she's. Technically, a big bug. I mean, at all. I can Listen. easily understand. I've met someone and you're jealous. What? How does that maybe for you to conceive an actual woman finds me attractive? We're on the subject. What kind of a girly name is Angel anyway? Does it have to do that? kind of bugs me. Look, bugs you. Gotta... And I'll just bugging you. Hi. Come on in. This beautiful chest dress I've ever seen. Martini? Oh, I'm sorry. Would you like something else? <laughs> I just need to relax Juice a bottles. little. Cool as a cucumber. I like cucumbers. Like in that Greek salad thing with the yogurt. Can I ask you a personal question? Have you ever been with a woman before? Like in uh, the same room? You know what you mean, I mean. like in reality? Um, yeah, there was uh, <laughs> several. She was incredibly no. Uh -uh. No. I know. You might say I need it. You know. I need Buffy you in should here. Definitely be mad as right now. Like Breaking shit. Day. Do you hear? No. It sounds like someone crying. I don't hear any hands are so hot. Oh, you hurt your hand. Buffy. <laughs> I love Buffy. Do you hear? Would you like to touch me with those hands? The martini, I... I really think I... <laughs> Miss... Fred? Got it. Coroner's report. Complete with... Yuck. Color picture. I don't like this. <sighs> it's the way they feed, head first. It's also the way they mate. See? Xander is... I like his eyes and his hair and his adorable Hey, smile. hey, take it easy. We're not in oh. any immediate danger. I saw him. Here is Anna Sharpie for his existence at this very moment. You gotta get me out of here. You gotta. She, Buffy. She, she gets you in there. Yeah, I saw. What did she do? She, 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 she takes you out of the gates and she ties you up. And I'm shooting out of her. And then what? And then, then what? She mates with you. You got a plan? What is it? Just uh, let me perfect. Buffy okay. is the only plan. You, you were right all along about everything. Well, no, no, you weren't right about your mother coming back as a peak in these, but. Uh, well, basically, the, uh, the she mantis assumes the form of a beautiful woman and then lures innocent virgins back. Xander's not a. Uh, uh, <laughs> I mean, he's probably gonna die. Tips on the snapping part? 
Uh, Carlyle recommends cleaving all body parts with a sharp blade. Slice and dice. This beast is extremely dangerous. <coughs> well, your buddy Carlyle thinks so he's he still around. Beast. Yes, in a strange. You didn't tell her where. See if you can get her address off the substitute rules. And you Hello, need to record easily bat do that. So bats eat them. The mantis here sonar its entire nervous system in the vid library. There are no books, but it's dark and musty. You'll feel right at home. Go into yours. What'd you do that for? Weapon. Think you're gonna need it. Getting the address. Great. Jazz? Lynch's personnel records. She was born in 1907. She's like 90 years old. And extremely well preserved. Ah, uh, he did that. He broke the cage. Take him, not me. Take him. What now exactly? We can't just kick the door down. Bullshit. Are you selling something? Because I'd like to help you out, but you see, I'm on a fixed income. Substitute biology teacher? Goodness, that's me. I taught for over 30 years. She's in Spencer's records to get into the school. She could be anywhere. No, dear. I'm right here. What are you doing? Mm. Hey. Me. Mm. Mine. Mo? What fucking better way to decide? Holy crap! You had to drag me out, buddy, by my legs, by my hair, by my ear. Boom! What do we do now? Abject prayer and supplication would spring to mind. It's not how she lives in this neighborhood. I'm gonna start banging on doors. Wait, no, we do not have time for that. Oh, yeah, here it comes. What? What's happening? How do you like your eggs, bro? Over easy or sunny side out? Eggs? Shut the fuck, we don't need your background commentary. You! Me. Oh, come on, which house is it? I know you're afraid of her. I saw her. Where is it? This is her house. This is it. It's better than rain. Say Buffy. Buffy! <laughs> Taught me, you do your homework, you learn stuff. Like what happens to your nervous system when you hear this? Child, it's the wrong side. There we go. Plays the wrong side again. Go to hell. You can go there with it. Say it's deceased. And dissected. But you're okay. It's so unfair how she only went after virgins. What? I mean, here you guys are doing the right thing, the <laughs> smart thing. When a lot. I am not. Wait, she, that's the she meant to say. Ever on? As a lawyer, anybody repeats this to anybody, they're gonna find themselves facing a lawsuit. Blaine, shut up. Sweet. Certainly nothing I'll ever bring up again. <laughs> Angel. So your shit gets taken care of. Remember there was uh, one less vampire walking around making a nuisance. I should thank you for the tip. Pleasure's mine. Of course, it would make things easier if I knew how to get in touch with you. I'll be around. Anyway, you can have your jacket back. Looks better on you. <laughs> oh boy. Yes. One third of your grade will be dependent on those papers. No more. Oh. Not good. We have it, guys. Season one, episode four of Buffy. This was an okay one. Uh, we did have some really good things, and this freaking shape shifting ass bug we dealt with was a problem. And the things it was about to do to Xander and just wanted to do to to virgins um, was truly some awful stuff and we were about to see the worst things go down. But Buffy, get in there in time. Buffy was great in this episode, using her smarticles all throughout. Um, loved how she went and got the vampire that was scared of her to to get the right address because we did not have that and... 
Uh, ran into a huge problem there. But Buffy, she was amazing. Xander, his awkwardness is definitely growing on me with each episode. I think this was his best episode yet. Um, I just really enjoyed this episode for him. Uh, but we got some, some good stuff from everyone again. And... Uh, um, I, I did enjoy it. It probably for me was the weakest so far, but still some good stuff. Once again, MVP, MVP for this one, will give it to, we'll give it to Buffy. Um, once again, she was incredible all throughout. Loved her scene at the beginning with Mr. Gregory. Loved Freaking the way she found the address to take out this damn thing and save Xander. Love her line before whooping this thing's ass. Like, this, this shit makes your whole freaking nervous system go to hell. And you're going to be there with it. Love the shot of her beating this thing to death. Um, just some good stuff there. But once again, Xander, it was also his best episode. And yeah, just hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out.